हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द ऑनलाइन स्पोकन इंग्लिश क्लास इन दिस मॉड्यूल वी शैल नो अबाउट सम मोर कॉमनली कंफ्यूज्ड वर्ड्स लेट अस लुक एट दीज फेयर एंड फेयर बोथ द वर्ड्स साउंड अलाइक बट हैव डिफरेंट मीनिंग्स these are homophones fair means to perform in a specific way fair also means the money paid for a journey on public transport on the other hand fair means beautiful lovely light good just it also means a gathering for the sale of goods let's read the examples please repeat after me durga fared well in her studies how much is the bus fare she has a fair complexion we are going to the book fair this weekend the next one is farther and further farther expresses distance and further expresses that which is additional and also means more let's read the examples please repeat after me we had to walk farther than the map indicated we need to research further into the matter let's look at these flee flee and fly flee is a blood sucking insect to flee means to run away fly is an insect fly also means movement through the air or wind let's read the examples please repeat after me there are fleas in the bed the policeman caught the fleeing thief by the arm ostriches can't fly there is a fly in the cup now look at these flower flower and floor flower is ground grain flower is the colored part of the plant from which the seed or fruit develops it also means bloom floor is the ground surface of a room or of the ocean let's understand with the help of these examples 
Please repeat after me. He bought a lot of flour and oil. Rose is a lovely flower. The floor of this room is of marble. The next one is forceful and forcible. Forceful means full of force or powerful. Forcible means done by force or compulsion. Let's read the examples. Please repeat after me. Mahatma Gandhi's peaceful but forceful demonstrations won India its freedom. The burglar made a forcible entry into the apartments. The next one is four and four. F-O-R-E means situated or placed in front. F-O-U-R-4 is a number. Let's read the examples. Please repeat after me. Male bears fight by striking with their four paws. I have four chairs in my room. Let us recapitulate. In this module, we have learned the correct usage of certain commonly confused words. Thank you.